Good day, Domic Nation, and welcome to the vlog. What a great opener. Oh. Bye to Carol. Bye. Got a wave every morning. Got a wave. Good kitty. All right, just uh, finishing up the vlog, and it's like 10 after 8. So I'm very happy about that. Uh, I guess what I could do this morning is put together Jen's review that Jen sent me from England, uh, put that together and have it scheduled to go up on Saturday uh, because today I have to go out and it's going to be a busy day, man. Um, basically, I'll have to leave here at like 10.30, zip down to Bradford, shoot the, um, what's it called? The uh, something, a Popeyes video for Friday, and I also want to shoot a Thirsty Thursdays. I'll shoot the Thirsty Thursdays with this camera. Get that done out of the way, and uh, then I guess I have to come back here and edit that as quickly as possible. Get that out for three o'clock today, and then I have to go down to Paul's house, shoot the cook and review. But I won't touch the uh, Popeyes video until tomorrow morning. Um, but I'm driving. Megan and her friend to a uh, cosplay thing and uh, or it's like an anime north I believe cosplay north anime north and uh, so they're going to that event and so I have to drive them down to that which is going to eat up some of my day but while I'm down that way I'm also doing another v review for Monday hmm, what could I do okay just launched the vlog it is 9:25. Um, I had a bit of a panic attack because I couldn't find the footage to the food review I did for uh, Jennifer from England who sent me those English snacks and uh, I went through every single clip and one of the things I do when I put the card in the card reader is I grab all the files and drag it where it's supposed to go um, and then once it's moved off the card, I erase the card and that's that. Yeah, it gets scarier. Uh, so that's one of my moves that I do to make sure I don't lose anything. Second move is I grab all that footage and I drag it into compressor, compress the footage uh, so that it's ready for uh, editing. What you, do, what you do is you highlight it all, drag it into compressor, it compresses, and when it's finished compressing, all those clips, let's say, let's call them the raw clips before they're compressed, they're all still highlighted, so you can drag them all off, and I put them into a trash file for like maybe anywhere from two days to a month. Uh, and then that trash file just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger when I start losing uh, space then I throw it in the garbage and toss it out. Well, I just tossed it out and then I realized I am missing this footage. So long story short, uh, I forgot that when I was at the cottage, I moved all the footage off that card that had Jennifer's food review on it, moved it onto my hard drive because I was editing the vlog stuff, which was on the same card. Uh, so I found it. It was on my on my laptop, so I'm pretty happy about that. Kitties are hungry. Got to move the food around. Eat the food. You come over here. Sunny's there. You come here. Sunny wants to eat there. Jeez, it's garbage day. Just gonna show you what's. They're getting a septic system still done. It takes a really long time. So it's noisy for the last week, week and a half. So what we got here is we got our plastics, glass, and metal. We got our cardboard. We got our uh, compostable stuff. Uh, and then we've got our two bags of garbage. And I'm gonna sneak a bag onto my neighbor's property. He doesn't mind if he's not home. And he's not home today and he, hadn't, he didn't put out his garbage. So uh, just triple checking. Yeah, he's not home. He didn't put any garbage. So I'm gonna use his spot I'll put all that stuff out and then we'll uh, get busy on Jennifer's video. It is super nice day out. Fortunately, it's probably gonna rain. We got the town cutting the grass in the uh, park. 
field, whatever. Neighbors cutting his grass, everybody's getting ready for the rain. Cut before the rain. It's a good idea. There's the garden. It's looking good. Starting to come together. Tulips are starting to wither. It's just uh, an ornament. Oh, we got a we got somebody digging. And I like these ones. They're nice big. Oh, these are the big leaf ones. Hostas, regular hostas. These are called bleeding hearts. Check those out. Aren't they cool or what? Carol loves these ones. And that's my burning bush. The other one died. We used to have one over there that we bought last year. We planted it with you guys. So it's a dwarf burning bush. All right. Time to get back to work. This is work. We are on our way down to Bradford to uh, Popeyes to do the garlic Parmesan chicken thing. And uh, got everything done. I'm, I don't, I won't have time to put out a Thursday Thursdays today. I don't think without stressing myself out too much. It's possible, but highly unlikely. But uh, I might shoot one for next week and put it up for next week. I just don't have time. So I gotta get, I gotta shoot this, go back, compress the footage, get it ready to edit for tomorrow. Uh, and there's no time to, I'll try. <laughs> Like, trying to think, depends on what time Paul wants me to be there. And I'm thinking about date night with, with Carol tonight. But it depends on how she feels. <clears throat> <clears throat> Made it down to Bradford, and there's the Popeyes right there. Popeyes, Louisiana kitchen. And it's a garlic pepper chicken thing I'm going to try today. Uh, I'm not going to show you guys the setup, because I just showed you one. I'll probably do that like once a month, maybe. Uh, maybe twice, I don't know. Because you always get new people on. They always want to see what you're doing. So uh, I'm going to set up, eat my food, and then go home. Just finished the video. Uh, as that was my last shot out of three. And that's as good as it got. So you guys will see that uh, if you're watching this video before 3 o'clock on Friday. Uh, so right now I'm just going to head home, get some other stuff done. And then I guess I'll text Paul and see what time he wants me to come down to his house. We are finally getting some rain. And we're also getting a little bit of a thunder storm. Let's see if you guys can hear the, I don't think the cats will escape. I'm heading through a Bradford on my way down to Paul's house. We're going to, we're going to be cooking uh, the grilled cheese Hopefully it's not too monstrous uh, because I am still full from my Popeye's lunch. Oh boy, I'm definitely gonna be skipping dinner tonight. All right, I'm back in Paul's backyard once again. And uh, what are we cooking? This is just for the vlog. Give people a heads up. We're gonna do some crazy grilled cheeses. I guess I gotta think of a name for it too. Crazy grilled cheese. Hmm. <laughs> well, not really, I don't like that name. The double... We're doing double dinner. deck, double decker sausage yes. grilled channel. Yeah. Uh, it's got to be something weird named. Yes. Like backyard. I'm not sure if backyard uh, poutine was the right name to name that, but. But we did have poutine in the backyard. But we did. It was in the backyard. This could be uh, backyard grilled cheese. Oh, uh, it could, we could do like something sexual, like sexual innuendo because it's knackwurst, sausage. Knackwurst. <laughs> Reuben grilled cheese. Because a Reuben's a sauerkraut, we have Swiss. What else do you put in a Reuben? Well, it's, it would be... There's a certain meat, right? Yeah, corned beef. Do we have corned beef? No. Can't call it a Reuben, then. No. Oh, we can't, there's kind of a twist on it. There's a reason that. Knackwurst, and it is a type of meat. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently. And the more mistakes we make, the more comments we get. So yes. We could just, like, total bullshit We will way think of it. a name. We will think of a name just for you. Just for you. And we got two different beers today. So Coors Altitude 
And then if you get too much strong beer, if you drink way too many of those, you'll get altitude sickness, sickness and you may vomit. <laughs> and then Actually, not that you may, you will. You will vomit because six drink. six point four percent alcohol, and this one has one. Oh, five point two, which is more than normal. Most beers in Canada are five even. You get some. It'll be nice with our sandwiches too, Dijon mustard. Oh, right, with the sauerkraut. With the sauerkraut and the sauerkraut. And you have sandwich. stuff in the fridge? I do. Okay, we'll do it. We'll so there's like this. I like showing you guys. So this is what's happening next week. So we've got the cheese. We've got two times types of cheese. Yeah, we've got Swiss and cheddar. Like, I put just it put it in the same inside. package just right. to make life easy to carry out. Sauerkraut, sauerkraut, basil, that, that, we'll put some onion that. Really I'm glad you're using that bread because it's smaller. And we can stack it up. Because I, I did um, a food review today at Popeye, so I'm Ooh. still a little full. Ooh. I'm Popeye the Sailor Man. Beep, beep. Paul and I just finished uh, our sandwiches. Uh, I, I, I don't think you can call that a sandwich. That was beyond a sandwich. That was a Goliath. A Goliath. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so the beers are gone. The sandwiches are gone. It's cleanup time. Thanks, buddy. No problem at all. I, can, I don't need to eat till tomorrow. When your stomach sits on... When your stomach says no, <laughs> take Eno. <laughs> I haven't heard that in a long time. And now it's time for happy birthday shoutouts for Friday, May 27th, and they are Stephen, Angus, Garrett, Ken, nice name, Fabio, Corey, Paul K, Mike, Patrick, Ua, Zuhib, and Diana. Happy birthday to every single one of you guys. Don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below as to what you had for your special birthday dinner, whether you ate in or you ate out. Happy birthday. Thank <laughs> you.